is how a lot of scary movies get started, and I don't want to find out what's up next, so let's just uh, hurry this shit up. George is about to pee his pants, but I got a last minute lead on this casket factory that uses gold and silver. Hi, gentlemen, how you doing? Good, how are you? So what can I do for you guys today? Uh, I came actually looking for old caskets. A lot of times they'll have uh, gold or silver inlays on them. Mm -hmm. We have some stuff in the back. I can take you guys back there and take a look at it if you'd like. Yeah, let's go see what you got. OK, just follow that me out to the like back. Fun. What is this? And what's in these boxes? This is where they carry the bodies. How freaky would it be if you just like saw your name written on the box? Yeah, OK, <laughs> let's just hurry up, yeah? I saw one casket, it was mostly white and had some silver on it, but it was plated, it's pretty much worthless. All right, that's enough, let's just go, come on. Hold on, check this one out. Right as we're about to leave, I see one last one kind of on a middle shelf. There's some really shiny handles that look like gold from what I can tell underneath the plastic. I'm gonna need to take this one down. Whoa, check out these letters. This is weird. Why does this one casket have customized letters on it? Whatever the reason is, it looks like they're made of gold, and that's why I'm here. If these are solid gold, this is a score right here.